Welcome to Celebrating Act 2. Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life. Hi, I'm Donna Lynn from Figure and Trim. You're at Celebrating Act 2 and this is short and sweet because I'm going to show you one exercise tip and one nutritional tip to make you healthy and strong. Today, I'm going to show you one of my favorite exercises. It just feels so good through the shoulders and the back, waist, hip, a lot of places for a small little exercise, don't you think? All right, let's go to it. So I'm going to lay down and I'm going to lay on my side. All right, so I'm going to just get down here. I'm going to lay on my side and I'm going to take those arms out in front of me. And my legs can just be bent and comfortable, kind of like, okay? My arms are out in front of me. My palms face each other. Now my head just for the moment dangles, so don't worry about that too much. I'm going to take a straight arm up over my head, follow it with my eyes, and then take that arm all the way down, try to get that shoulder hand on the ground. <sighs> Deep breathing. Oh, that feels so good. <sighs> Now, I want to hold this for a couple seconds here, but I'm going to come back here again, and we're going to make it a little more of an active stretch. Okay, and then we're going to do that again, up and over, follow it with your eyes. Get those shoulders down on the floor. Oh, that feels so good. It really does. Did I say that before? It does feel good. I can tell you that. Okay, we're going to do one more. Now, when you do these, you can do two or three like I've just done kind of warms up the joints a little bit and gets things moving, gets the blood moving, gets a little easier each time. And then finally on the third or fourth one, you're going to just stay here for about 20 to 30 seconds. And as you do, you can just take deep breathing, breaths in, excuse me, you're just going to take deep, deep breaths in and exhale out. And you're going to just relax your body, relax the shoulder and the arms. And you'll see that shoulder sliding down to the floor. Really nice. And of course, you've got to come back. Now, you know you got to do it to the other side, right? Right. <laughs> A couple times each side and then hold it. Yeah, really good. All right. Today, we're going to talk about prunes. <laughs> All right. Now, why? Well, because prunes, they're finding out that prunes actually helps prevent uh, some of that osteoporosis when we get older. You know, so it helps uh, to keep, stave off that stuff. Why? Because it can reduce the inflammation and the oxidative stress, which brings that on. All right. Now, prunes are a little bit different than other fruits and vegetables, which also have a lot of those same qualities that can stop and hold back the inflammation and, and the stress. But the prunes have uh, minerals, vitamin K, and they have phenolic uh, compound, which actually reduces it a little bit more. Yeah. So how would you do that? Well, you want to start out slow, right? So one or two prunes on a plate and then maybe get up to five or six, about 50 grams a day. All right. All right. So, hey, you know why I do this. I do this to keep you healthy and strong so you can look good, feel good and move well. So come visit us next week. This is Celebrating Act 2. I'm Donna Lynn, short and sweet. See you soon. For more on Celebrating Act 2, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends. Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life.